Hello YouTubers out there, this is Jerry Saravia at the Movies. Now I want to discuss something uh, that a film critic on uh, YouTube discussed, who I follow and uh, have been listening to his reviews for quite some time, Chris Stuckman. So he mentioned that uh, during this whole pandemic, he's been watching films and reviewing them uh, via streaming, that is Netflix or Amazon or whatever and that somehow the films don't have the same impact that they do uh, when you watch them in a movie theater. That is to say, they don't even seem to register with them, that they don't stay with them, it doesn't seem to linger after he's done watching them, because he's used to the movie theater experience. Now, there is a lot of truth to what he's saying. However, I feel that a film uh, if it's uh, not a mediocre film or a bad film, but a great film, can have an impact either way, when you're streaming it or when you're just uh, watching it in a movie theater. The movie theater is really where movies were meant to be seen. There's no question in my mind. I mean, that was always its primary design, uh, just by default. Ever since film was first out in 1895 and all the uh, films were showing in the um, penny arcades and the movie theaters and so on and so forth uh, at that time, that was the only way you could watch films prior to the advent of television. So the impact that a movie theater experience has is unequaled because you have no way to control it. It dominates you. It takes precedence over you. You can't pause, you can't use a remote to stop so you can use the bathroom or whatever the case may be. The movie theater experience is unequaled. In any other format that you choose to watch a film, the movie theater is the experience. So he is right about that. However, I mean, obviously, you know, there are going to be some films. Uh, there are going to be many films, but in particular, the epic films. 2001 A Space Odyssey, Fantasia, Lawrence of Arabia, The Robe, uh, Gone with the Wind, even, you know, Wizard of Oz, certainly, which has, you know, that 4-3 format. Nevertheless, these films, if you see them in a movie theater, it just, it transcends everything. It just does. So... If you see them on video or television for the first time, the experience is still magical, but the added effort is the communal experience, an audience, the sound, and at least at one time, film projectors. Uh, now you have digital projectors, but the experience is not, even if it's not the same, it doesn't change the fact that the impact a film can have on you, no matter how you watch it will still be largely the same. Uh, it has greater impact, of course, in a movie theater. That's the most truthful, honest way to watch a film. Any film, really. Um, but, uh, and there are many that I wish I had seen on a big screen, and as I mentioned before, I wish I had seen 2001 in Space Odyssey on a big screen. But uh, sometimes the nuances uh, can be more apparent on video or streaming, other times more so in a movie theater. It depends on what kind of film you're watching. Um, first time I saw Natural Born Killers was in a movie theater, and it, the impact of that film was tremendous, but I hated the film. Uh, and then when I saw it on video, I started to see the nuance. Uh, it's subtle. Uh, some of it, of course, is really <laughs> over the top and in your face, to be sure. I mean, it's the sledgehammer style of Oliver Stone, which I do appreciate, by the way. I do like that style, because he's still trying to tell a story. He's still trying to say, wake up, America. But um, at any rate, whenever I see a film for the first time, if it's at home, in a movie, uh, or on video, DVD, Blu-ray, or streaming, if it has an impact, it will still have an impact on me. It still lingers if it's a good film, or if it's a great film. So that's where I disagree with him. Uh, but make no mistake, the movie theater is the most honest, truthful way to watch any film. And that's all i got to say about it. Let me your thoughts, and please subscribe. Uh, hit that button, and hit like, and hopefully...
hopefully I'll bring you more videos as we go on. There's a whole lot more stuff I want to um, talk about, uh, in particular to the changing scene in American movies uh, in as far as, once again, the theatrical experience uh, due to this pandemic. So, that's all i got to say for now. This is Jerry Sadovian Movies. Signing off.